I want you to listen now what uh, Professor Henry Louis Gates tells as a uh, dispute or as the other side to this to uh, my colleague Soledad O'Brien last night. I haven't heard from Sergeant Crowley. I would be prepared to listen to him if I were convinced that uh, if he would tell the truth about what he did, about the distortions that he fabricated in the police report, I would be prepared as a human being to forgive him. That would not deter me from using this as an educational opportunity for America. Because if this can happen to me in Harvard Square, this can happen to anybody in the United States, and I'm determined that it never happened to anybody again. You know what's interesting about that, Boyce, is, uh, and I'm not sure if maybe because he wasn't asked or he didn't get a chance, but the officer gave us detail, moment by moment, of exactly what happened, and he doesn't give us any details. Yes, he does. D don't you want to know? Okay, please, tell me. He but gave an interview to the Washington Post well, two so days he ago he, he where gave he an detailed interview, but that happened. doesn't mean that he was given the detail. I mean, the thing is, I'm not trying to say that Skip Gates is lying or that right. he's making Nobody this up. Is. What I'm trying to say is that we don't know what happened. And let me tell you one important fact that's being missed here. And I did my research. I talked to several officers and several black scholars to get both sides of this issue. Uh, one thing about a breaking and entering is that if you are, look like you're breaking into your own home and you present ID showing that you belong in that home, that does not mean that the officer should stop asking questions and just walk away. Did you know, Rick, that one-third of all women who are murdered in America are murdered by their former lovers, which are typically, in many cases, men who live in the house, who broke into the house, the, violated and restraining well, order to I hurt the Well, I can take spouse. it a step further. Uh, that's not what Professor Gates is doing, uh, uh, but we have to consider that. According to what I'm reading right here, what the officer says, again, we take him at his, uh, at his word, he says he didn't even believe that Gates was a suspect. He had heard the report the woman, Miss Wiley, filed is that there were two men breaking into his house, two young men. When he two saw Gates, with he backpacks. said, who's that older guy? He mm. wanted to get Gates away from the house because he wanted to protect him from the two guys he thought may have broken into his house. That's gotcha. what he says. And, and, That's what and, he says. And, wait, wait, wait. But again, but also when uh, Gates sat there, gave him his ID, gave him the Harvard ID, uh, you're sitting here with the ID, you're seeing, look, the man in front of you and the address, you're in the home. Now, Gates has talked about it. Gates gave his own description of what happened in an interview to TheRoot.com, which he is the founder of, and The Washington Post. So don't say, Rick, that he has not given his version. He has. Well, in fact, earlier in the interview with Soledad, he talked about and described what happened. The clip you played was simply the wrong clip. Okay, it was a more all right. The bottom line, though, is that none of us were in this house. All we know is that a black, prominent Harvard professor was arrested by a white police officer. And it, it doesn't mean racial profiling doesn't happen. So we why have to are we fight taking that. the what it takes to fight it so, good. So but why are we, we taking the police reports as just because of, of what someone says? No, no. So why are well, we taking the police? So why are we taking the police report? Let's listen to him. I'll tell you what. I'll, get, I'll give you. I'll give you more information. Maybe we can uh, chew on here. The police officer, Mr. Crowley, it turns out, and I've just learned uh, the Associated Press is reporting. Uh, he is an expert on racial profiling, has taught at the Academy on Racial Profiling for five years, and gave an interview this morning to WEEI, a radio station there, about why he ended up arresting a guy who he says he tried to leave the residence of and walk away from. Here it is. He was arrested after following me outside of the house, continuing the tirade even after being warned multiple times, probably a few more times than the average person would have gotten. How many times? Uh, I believe, well, it, it, he was cautioned in the house, meaning, I, you know, calm down, lower your voice. Uh, once we got outside in front of the general public and the police officers were assembled there, two warnings. Uh, the second warning was with me holding a set of handcuffs in my hands, and, and, and something I really didn't want to do, mm -hmm. but I... I the professor at any point in time could have brought that he could have resolved the issue by quieting down and or going back in his house. And by the way, here's what the neighbors say about that altercation. They were in the front yard, some people who just happened to be there called by the commotion and they watched it. Here's what they say. Mr. Gates appeared to be agitated and I did not see any of the policemen agitated or making any fast moves, quick moves or anything. So I would have to say, you know, it was, uh, it was probably Mr. Gates who was a little bit uh, as the police report said, belligerent. Do you believe that Professor Gates was belligerent? I believe he was out of control. I, I, I didn't hear anything that he was saying, so I couldn't say that he was belligerent. I couldn't mm -hmm. definitely say that he was belligerent.
By the way, we're going to continue this conversation on wow. CNN.com slash live because I know it's, it's a good conversation. It's one Americans should be having. But it takes us back to the first question. Given all the stuff that we've just seen, that's not to say Gates was wrong. That's not to say the officer is wrong. Should President Obama had gone on national television last night and decided that the officers acted stupidly? In arresting him after proving that was his home. You have to add that, Rick. Well, but if you know, Rick, it, Rick, the, Rick, you you cannot have a half of a sentence if you don't have the second half. Well, let me let me help you here. If Read he the had, sentence. Are you saying no one's allowed to be arrested in their front lawn? No. If what he said. No. Think what he said wrong? was they acted stupidly in arresting him after establishing that he was the homeowner. That was the quote. But don't give half a quote, Roland. I mean, okay, that's we, fair. we have to Vice. be honest on this, Roland. I mean, the, I'm the, being the, honest. Obama, he had the right President to say Obama, what he said, boy. But. But, but and you know you're my friend, and President Obama is a respected leader. I like the guy, mm -hmm. but I think he made a mistake. I, he, w he killed the press conference, did a great job, and then on that part, you don't start a conversation by saying, this is my buddy from Harvard, I don't know all the facts, I'm admittedly biased, but these people behave stupidly. That's just not a good move no, on the part of the president. No, they behave stupidly and, and in arresting him that. after it was do you think, Boys, Do you Boys, think Crowley's you, a racist? No, I didn't. First of all, I don't but, know Crowley. I don't know his background. Well, do you know well, no, no, what you, Rick, Rick, what you Rick, read? I'm I'm sure, did you Rick, read the case? Rick, Rick, I will finish the comment. All I right. do not know Crowley. I have never met Crowley. I am not going to call somebody a racist. Do I know arrogant SOB cops who don't like being questioned? Absolutely. Do you think professors I, can be arrogant? Do, well, do you, you know, think my, professors can be arrogant? My dad was a cop SOBs? for 28 years, and my, my dad was a cop for 28 years, and I know a lot of arrogant cops too, but I also know a lot of good cops who do their job, put their lives on the and line. I, and, and I know arrogant professors and these good kinds professors. Of attacks. Right. There you go. And so the, the, the question is, it's not a matter of saying that Gates was right or that the officer was right. It's a matter of saying, let's get the witnesses. Let's do a thorough investigation. Let's not just apologize yeah, because someone from Harvard was arrested. That's just not and, the way to go. And let's also not opinion. sit here and read a police account and automatically assume that it is absolutely, oh, well, no, positively did. No, correct no. 100%. That's a good it's point. Because, yeah, because yeah, he can also Roland, have his own spin but it's to his own purposes. But Roland, it's the record. I mean, as that's a journalist, right. no, no, no. if it's, it's his on the record, record, I read It's not the record. It's his record just like his story is that, not that always is history that's true it could be his story well but once you go that, down that's that true road, it, it, no, it, no, it, Rick, does anything Rick, matter Rick, does anything no. any public official i mean the man the man is an expert on racial profiling Rick, teaches Rick. other police but that, officers that, 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 but but Rick, how many times have we seen cops Rick, so, come on so how many that. times have we seen cops put down uh, information in a record and it's still their perspective, and another cop says, so, well, that's not how I saw it. I'll ask Come you on one. Now. I'm okay, not right, I'll right. tell you what. Here's, here's, here's the deal. <laughs> we, we need to move forward on, uh, the Attorney General needs to move forward on investigating racial profiling. Because yes. It, whether, no matter what happened here, there are exactly. millions of, of African-Americans and Hispanics. But that's just it. The President didn't Hispanics put it in those terms. This is what I want to do something about that. I, 